across the lifespan and we needed to do a teaching project, so we're going to teach you guys about sophomore year and what to expect. So I'll just introduce myself again. That's Brittany. She's in snow. Um, I'm Miranda. I'm Lizzie. I'm Amanda. Oh, here we go. All right, so can everyone take out a piece of paper? Um, we're going to start by doing a pre-assessment to see what you already know about uh, nursing the sophomore year. So the first question is, how confident are you? But, okay, so number one is going to be, how confident are you about next year on a scale of 1 to 10, with 1 being you're not confident at all, and 10 being that you have no doubts at all? And then number two, list three things you have heard about sophomore year. It can be like any, just like anything you've heard from people, or like things that you know, things that you've read about it. This is all anonymous, so you don't throw your name right Oh yeah, so that's not worry about that. Number three is, what is ATI? You probably don't know, but that's okay. <laughs> Number four, what is simulation lab? Number five, what do you do at clinical? <coughs> and number six, what is DocuCare? Um, now we're just going to do the post assessment. So the same questions that I asked you, if you guys could take that sheet and flip it over, and then answer the same questions one through six. <laughs> I know this is like super weird because you're in front of so many people you don't really know yet and you might have a lot of questions. I know I had a lot of questions but I just didn't want to raise my hand. But you guys are going to get to know each other anyway so any comments or concerns would be awesome. Yeah. Should we get our LMA certification at some point? Uh, once you completed, is it one semester? Once you completed the first semester of sophomore year, you're allowed to, you have to pay like a certain fee. Yeah, so you don't have to the take the test. test. Yeah. Okay, but you just pay a certain fee and then you'll take it. Yeah. Any other questions? You can even ask this. Oh, yeah. Um, I thought that you'd be able to wear like long sleeves under the scrubs. How important is covering tattoos? Like, um, uh, no one in my clinical has tattoos, yeah, so I don't really know. I'm sure that like it depends on facility, but for the most part, you do you would cover them just to be professional. About the sleeves thing, like. No one really wears the sleeves underneath. I know some people, sometimes people do it in like open lab or something, but. Um, the first, well, in your sophomore year, you're going to be in geriatrics, so. It's really hot. Roots are going to be 100 <laughs> degrees. I'm telling you right now, you're going to be sweating in just this. Oh, so. and if you are cold, um, I don't know if you guys remember, but it was on the slide that when we put up the lab coat that you have to buy, you can wear that over your scrubs. Yeah. So. Kind of strict. Push it, just follow it as much yeah, as you can. Yeah. Yeah. You're going to the totem pole there. <laughs> <laughs>I'm taking an LNA course over the summer. Uh -huh. um, do you think that's like a bad idea? No, that's a great idea. Okay. You'll like come in knowing a lot then. Because I knew nothing going in about LNA and stuff. Like you have to like go into the nursing home and like give them bed baths. Like I've never given a bed bath before and like wipe someone's butt and stuff. But like it's really rewarding to see that you're helping everyone out. Yeah. It's really cool. It's a good yeah. idea. Yeah, it's a good idea. Yeah. Unless. Yeah. Um, yeah. 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 I mean, it's pretty basic. Yeah. Like, helping people yeah. function. I know. I'm taking, like, a certification thing, so I can, like, start maybe working over the summer. Yeah. Like, I'm going to try to get a job at, like, on the summer.